Welcome back to Destination Playdate. I am your host, Tax Slug. Today's game is called Castle Helios, out now on itch for a price of $7. Now, if you own the previous game in the franchise, The Wizard's Apprentice, there is a 15% launch discount on that price. Limited time, though. So, let's hop in to the third game. In the franchise. There was the Conquest of Helios, kind of like a Risk type game. There was the Wizard's Apprentice, kind of a Drug Wars type game. And here we are in Castle Helios, which is a puzzle platformer, a genre I like quite a bit. So I am the Wizard. This is a prequel to the previous game. And if I undock the crank, there's the map. Now, that does not pause the game. So be wary of undocking to get your map. I just got the fireball spell and I saved the game here at the statue. That is very important, saving the game, because if you die without saving, guess what? You're starting back where you were. So my goal here is to get six keys. And also the statue will tell you what percentage complete you are of the game. I am currently at 11% on this save file. So right now I can go to the shop and spend some crystals. I have three crystals and I can buy things like more health, return, which is I don't know, and a plus one on my fireball. So not going to do any of those. I only have three and not going to spend those just yet. But let's move on with where we currently are because I now have this fireball spell. I can shoot. I also have a spell to levitate. And yes, you can also le levitate, change spell, and then fireball. Very important. So changing your spell is on the B button. And there are more spells to find, obviously, but here we are with this enemy in the way, so let's roast that enemy and finally move on in this level. There's a door here I can't open just yet. Let's head up this elevator and see what there is to see, because I do enjoy... Ah, uh, it's a ghost! I do enjoy a good puzzle platformer all day er day. So can I... Hmm... The map says that I'm at a dead end on the left side, but what if there was a secret? Just curiously, what if there was... No, alright. There's no secret there. I can't get that high. So, let us get back down on the ground, re-equip the fireball, and continue our way through oh, this castle, and try to solve some of these puzzles, and deal with these demonic creatures. Okay, that is a platform I can just fireball through and then roast that turkey. But here, I can't get through this brick wall just yet. I'm sure there's a thing to solve there with that. Who knows? But can I get up on the ledge here? Yes, I can. Which to me says, what if I murdered every enemy in this room? Would that improve things here for me in this? We'll see. So, fire. Come on, man. Okay, that didn't do anything. And yes, the enemies do respawn after you leave and come back old school style. So, I can't get that open just yet. Let's head up and see what is up on the following floor. We have an NPC, perhaps? Yes! Queen Reno Serp. So, you are the one who rid this castle of my wicked husband. There was no love in that creature's heart. So, I owe you a debt of gratitude. If you can bring me the scarf I lost, I can help you get through the doorway to the west. Into the central part of the castle. So, you say you owe me. Let's skip the scarf part. The queen smirks, but says nothing. Okay, I need that scarf. And that's gonna be... Alright, look over your head, and whatever. So she will open up that part of the map, which is to the west, to the right. And again, the enemies do respawn, so getting through that is gonna be, yeah. Yep, don't hit me, bro, because you get hit enough times. So at this point, I have three health pips. That's from getting an extra one in a hidden spot, but you get hit three times, it's back to the save point, and all that progress is gone, again old school style. So that door only opens when I find the scarf. And I have not seen any kind of scarf thus far in my adventures. So let's head back down 
and to see what else there is to see. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. And so, heading back down into the depths of the dungeon, we have additional things to find. So there was, over here, what I got was the extra bit of health in this room here. But I don't see anything that looks like a scarf, unfortunately, so no reason to go back in there for any particular issue. And let's continue heading on in this direction. And yes, this looks dangerous. There's fireballs. And they'll get one health pip if you hit them, and that ain't no fun. And so, because there is no jump button, we levitate, and you wait, and you go, and you wait, and you go, and you don't go too far. But, you know, typical video game 101 beardness. Now, I have the fireball. Oh, this puzzle. Okay, so, this is where I got stuck before, because that door does open, right? And what you want to do here is you want to crank the crank, going in front of the crank, then opening the crank, and so you see how it moves the urn or the the jar? You light the jar on fire, you heat it up, you cause the smoke from the jar, and then you move it here under the wheel. That opens the door. The problem that I found is it does not last long enough to actually make it through and do that properly. So I have to wonder if maybe the solution would be the fireball. And if I were to perhaps be up here and shoot a fireball, oh, look at that. I figured it out. Go! Okay, the first of six keys, we have found one. One key, the fire key. Okay, that's not a scarf though, so, you know, there's that. But, that is progress of the six keys, we have found one in our possession. This seems real neat, and I love a good puzzle platformer. Looking forward to playing more of this, certainly. And let's save, see where we're at here now. I am at 21% of the game. So, big jump there from finding that first key. But, I want to save my current game. I can get in your bed and sleep but I ain't got your scarf. So I can't help you with that, unfortunately, at this juncture. So let's talk one more time and say, yeah, uh-huh, same dialogue. Bring me the scarf. It's somewhere. I want to skip, but no, it's a video game. She smirks and says nothing and keeps repeating the same dialogue over and over again here in Castle Helios out now on itch link in the description seven bucks unless you bought their game previously and then you get a 50 percent launch discount i am your host attack slug keep on cranking more videos on this channel right here tune in i'll see you next time and i'm out